Hey guys, what is up? It's Gameface here, and welcome back to episode 22 of uh, my Ultimate Team Adventures. And today, um, we are going to be doing four matches in this one episode that's six minutes long. So that tells you that not a lot happens um, in some of the matches, but it is still worth uh, watching for some of the goals we score. Anyway, in the first game, uh, we do have a free kick later on, and Balotelli whips it round the wall and goes in the back of the net. Um, some of these goals you'll be seeing will be in my squad builders, that's partly because they, this is the footage I used, but I still wanted to use it in uh, an episode. Um, so I thought, you know, I didn't want to waste the footage, um, so I thought I would use it um, for this video. And uh, yeah, we do go 1 0 up, and um, that is how pretty much the game finishes. Nothing happens the whole match. It was quite a, a dull game, but I think it was because we were playing a tough team, and that was my first game with my new squad. Um, which you can go check out on the two squad builders which I've uploaded and um, they do go into another game with the same team uh, because this is the second match uh, that we'll be doing with this one and then I'll be doing two matches in this episode with my second team we do come up against an alright team actually a bit different um, right mid seems a bit out of place but um, I've not played against him before that I know of and um, tricky, get, uh, tricky team um, this I guess a red card for We'll watch it again on the replay, zoomed in. You'll see Yayatari doesn't really do a lot at all. Unbelievable, to be honest. Uh, Yayatari goes to the tackle, gets the ball, and kicks it miles away, and yet he gets sent off. That's not the frustrating bit, necessarily, because he goes and scores the free kick as well. So not only are we a man down, but we're a man down and a goal down as well. So um, that didn't really help us, 30th minute. Um, Carlos Tevez wh whipping one over the wall and in. Um, anyway, we decided to go on an attack and um, score with Pato just a couple of minutes later, uh, making it one all. And then uh, Tarat went through, and uh, you thought he was going to, you know, sweat it and score. He hits the post, and eventually Tarat goes and scores. I don't know how he hit the post with Hernandez. Um, open net, you know. And then I give away a penalty again, another bit of bad luck uh, from David Luiz who was just trying to do a pass but accidentally fouled him. Um, Tarat steps up to take it, I just go the wrong way, I was trying to wait until late and then I just went right as I always do pretty much. He made it 3-1, Wellerton makes it 3-2 in the 73rd minute, I was hoping for a late comeback to try and go on and win this one. Um, and Wellerton played absolutely fantastic this game towards the end and uh, again Wellerton made it 3 all in the 78th minute. And um, the match pretty much after that died out, uh, not a lot happened um, after that for the next sort of 10 minutes. Um, and that is how the game finished, you'll see that um, the goalkeeper just smacks it out and um, that is the end of the match. So in the first two games we won the first one and we drew the second one, meaning we're on 10 points now, that means we need 12 points um, to stay in the, div uh, two more points to stay in the division from the next three games. That was going to be a bit harder than I thought, um, because we came up against this team uh, with my second um, squad, which I have, and um, they go one nil up from uh, Mandzukic, and that was in the 49th minute, so not a lot happened in the first half, as you can see from that. Um, then literally straight away, so it's the 51st minute. I mean, it was just into the 50th minute, to be honest, uh, in-game. Manjuk Manjukic goes and makes it 2-0. Then 3-0 from Mats Hummels in the 68th minute. And um, that wasn't particularly good at all, because from then I knew we had no way back in the game. That wasn't it, though. They did go make it 4-0 from um, Blaskowski. I'm going to call him that. And that was late on in the game. Obviously, we had no chance from then. And uh, the game did end 4-0, so we did lose 4-0. Um, we had two games remaining to get three points, that's all we needed. And um, if we did win this next game, we'd be staying in the division and we'll have a bit more coins to spend. So, like I say, again, we're with our second team, this is our second match with it. And um, I was hoping for a slightly easier team this time, um, so I searched for an opponent. Came up against a, a Premier League team, which I was really happy with. That had a average defence, um, not a bad midfield, and uh, strikers were pretty sweaty. 
we do go score though um, from Abama Yang, and uh, he just finesses it round the goalkeeper. Pretty decent goal, actually. I was happy with that one, uh, making it one nil. And then uh, just after the first, uh, the second half started, uh, Esteban goes and makes it uh, two nil in the eight, um, in the forty eighth minute. And um, Sinclair goes and makes it 2-1 in the 62nd minute. Um, at that point, I was pretty annoyed because I knew I was going to give it away. And then Azuqueta, 2 all in the 80th minute. And I was going to be surprised if we were going to go and win this on 80th minute. We're not got much chance. We did, however, go on the attack, and um, you'll see in a second that. We did um, get a corner, you'll see now. Uh, we did have a corner, which we didn't do anything from. Podolski has the shot, gets saved. We get another corner, 90th minute. Goalkeeper isn't up. Koscielny heads it, gets a deflection, and goes in to go make it 3-2. 90th minute, that was literally the last kick of the game. A few replays there for you to watch and see how lucky that goal really was um, from our team. We don't normally do stuff like that, it's normally the other way around. Uh, we very rarely get a 90th minute goal uh, against a team. I think it's probably happened twice in this series. Um, and that is it guys, it ended 3-2. Thank you for watching, I'll see you next time. We now have, I think it's 38 grand or 36 grand to get commenting on players that you think I should get to upgrade my squad. And I'll give you a shout out for that. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time, guys. Goodbye.